Your poo burns. Oh. There we go. Hi. Well, hello, Sora. Yes. Hello there, somebody I don't know. Eeyore told me Pooh wasn't quite himself. I thought this might be just what the poor deer needed. Yeah, I hope it'll make Pooh better. Let's take us a wonderful thing. The top of the middle of the river, the bottom of the middle of the a present for me? <laughs> Why, presents are what Tigger's like best. And it's not even my birthday. <laughs> but Tigger, that's the not bouncy bouncy for you. Wait, Tigger! Oh, dear. Come on, let's go after him. Tigger is always bouncing around no matter where he is. He used to all bounce together, but it seems Pooh's forgotten that as well. If only Tigger would listen a little more. This is terrible. We have to get that medicine back now. We have to stop Tigger quick or he'll drink it all. He's just standing there. These me boxes read Kenga and Moo. <clears throat> Ooh, she got more help. Boost! So generous to me. There! <clears throat> A magic boost. What's. Who? What's everyone doing here? Is something going to take place? Maybe a honey competition? Or a race? Tigger. You're saying Pooh even forgot about me? Yes, Tigger. That battle you thought was a present is medicine to make Pooh better. Aw. Who needs medicine? Why, terrific bouncing will jog his memory for sure. I don't know about that, Digger. I don't for you. But sometimes medication is Well, Blue. That looks like fun to someone I don't know. Nothing, hmm? Of course. We all gotta bounce together. That'll do the trick. <clears throat> Not the target balloon, where the time runs out. Time your jump on the trampoline, breakfast in the triangle, bring it out to the triangle, and then to the special. Alright. <laughs> well, be fun. I bet you remember me now, don't you, Buddy Bear? <clears throat> well, I remember that bouncing always makes me hungry. All oh, that bouncing and he still doesn't remember me. Well, then I guess bouncing's not the answer. It makes a Tigger almost never want to bounce again. <laughs> oh, please be careful with that. Oh, sorry, little piglet. But Pooh not remembering me has me confused. I don't even feel like bouncing. Oh, but Tigger, I always thought that bouncing was what Tiggers did best. Pooh boy! <gasps> You remember me. You do remember your old buddy Tigger after all. <laughs> That's great.
I wonder who that is. Oh well, perhaps I'll remember tomorrow. I think we have two pages. Let's see if we go back. <laughs> oh, that seems like a dangerous place. Uh, I'm, just, I'm just wondering if I have any more pages in stock. Hey everyone. Uh oh, where's Pooh? He went in there. Why did he go in there? Do you think there might be a jaguar hiding inside? It's a really specific thing to think. Got it. Jaguar. Well now. That reminds me of my dear cousin. <laughs> Excuse me. And my dear cousin Alphonse. Say, why are you all sitting around? If you're worried about that bear, let's go find him. That's exactly what I was thinking. Yeah, let's go. But if there really is a jaguar, we better think this through. I don't know that there's going to be a jaguar. It seems we've got a bit of time. Why don't I resume where I left off? My cousin, that is, my father's younger sisters. What do you think we should do, Sora? Hmm, this place looks a tad dangerous. Okay, game, let's throw that while going through here. I can't imagine any of that honey who loves so much being in this place. The walls are hard yet crumbly, watch out for crawling moths. I can hear wings buzzing. I hope there aren't any bees in here. So if we're attacked by bees, please exterminate them. Grab it would be far better to relocate them as the bee population of the world is it's in peril. We should, we should help the bees. There's no way I'd find him even if I left. The ground's slippery here. I just hope I don't fall and lose my tail. I'll keep an eye out for you. This place is dark and feels like a maze. If I get lost, you'll find me, won't you, Sora? I can't find you. Tenga, voice of reason? Hey, Sora, maybe you should go find Pooh. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. Oh, wait, wait, um... And I want to see if there's, like, a fur or anything around here. No, okay. Let's see this. Alright, find Pooh is quickly fall. Sure, Chase will choose when your friends become lost while I wasn't. When your courage gauge is empty, your friends begin to panic. When your friends are being panicked, calm down by staying close to them. That's good advice. Unless, of course, they would share their. Not the bees! Not the bees! Yes. It's okay. It's okay. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. We're okay. 
welcome. How do I encourage you to be brave? you are. Hey, we looked everywhere for you. I was looking for a very dear friend that I remember I made a ten looked, but he doesn't seem to be anywhere. Oh, Pooh Boy, so there you are. But Tigger, did you have to bounce me so bouncily? Gosh, I thought a Jaguar had gotten you. Oh, dear. I hadn't thought of that. I do hope a Jaguar hasn't gone and gobbled up my friend. Now try to remember, Pooh. Isn't Sora the one you're looking for? Oh, the Jaguar! No, it's just your tummy grumbling. You must be hungry. Come on, let's head home and see if we can find you some honey. I'd like that, Sora. Pooh! <laughs> you finally remembered! Remembered what, Sora? Pooh. I like it ever so much when you're cheerful, Sora. Hmm. <laughs> Me too, Pooh. Oh, there's a bit of a oh, rumbling in my tumbly. Alright, then let's go home. Alrighty. <clears throat> Map there.
still a page missing. Castle. Oh, we haven't done that yet. Okay, Beast Castle. We for the tourney, which we can't do because that world is finished. Mulan did. Find the last page, working on it. Get my mirror. Oh, in Port Royal. Okay. Map right. New episode added. Where? 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 There we go. Usually when they're squirrely sparklies, there's an episode somewhere. There's one. There's one. Why, why did you take this away from us? Okay. Mm, I guess let's go to Beast Castle first. Lying out! Tonight goes well. So do I. But I wonder why he's so nervous. The master does have his shy side, you know. Hey there. No heartless and no nobody. I think they're close though. Oh, you want a
Maybe we came at a bad time. Well, there's only one way to find out. I think it's Donald. pretty clear we came at a bad time. Monsieur, Mademoiselle, please enjoy the evening. And of course, our honored guests are welcome too. A uh, welcome indeed. The organization! You don't know when to quit. Oh, yeah, well, sure, yeah. Get out! Not tonight. Thing you hold very dear. Yeah. didn't get him to take anything after now. <gasps> he took the... What's wrong? Belle? What's with them? Maybe Belle is the only thing that's precious to the beast? Come on. I've never seen the master in such a temper. When the man in black said, You have something. something you hold very dear, he couldn't have meant. What's going on? Should we chase after Bell too? Oh, this is awful. I believe he's heading to his chamber. So those things that attacked us were just a diversion? Yes. Can I show you what happened? Huh. Uh oh, 
what a swing. Good thing. Yeah. Rock. This is better. Yeah. Rock. Duck. West, if you come into the village, or west, if you're after the house, if you come in, right? This is the western. Yeah, okay. Look at me, I'm not western. You say if you're going to.
cube it's these Just had to have a party, didn't you? Don't you see what's happened? Hey, what's with you? The rose. My rose. What? That? He took it? But surely you can find another rose. Silence! You don't know anything! That's not fair, beast. Don't take it out on Belle. It's not like she stole it. <sighs> I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. But... Belle... Sora... I want you to leave the castle. Look at me. Look. This is what I am. When you first got here, I tried to change. But I was only fooling myself. I can't be any different. I'll always be a beast. So I should live like a beast. With no one alone. Goodbye, Belle. You can't mean that. Oh, I think his mind's all made up. Yeah. Look, Belle, leave this to us. If we can get the beast's rose back, he'll calm down. The poor child. And then we're still looking forward to this evening. Now, now, no need to be sad. What is there is this act? Can I explain this will all be over? What's so special about one room is anyway? If the master can love and be loved in return, the spell will be broken and we'll all be human again. Yeah, he told us. But there's a time limit. 
He must find his true love before the last petal falls from the rose. But that's not all. Over time, caring for the rose has become a cherished part of the master's daily life. It's as though all of his hopes and dreams are tied to that single bloom. For a beast. So we have to get it back. Please do. We can't do it without the booster. It's important to him. He's got to do it himself. Why didn't that be able to Would you mind asking that for me? I wouldn't mind. Might just be just when I thought the curse might be lifted, this happened. The master can be a bit, shall I say, over dramatic sometimes. Correct. Would you mind speaking with him for us, please? I'm sure that was too late five, but still I worry. would be where we put a rose, if we had one. Hey, beast! <sighs> Leave me alone. Come on, you need to hear this. You used to be fearless. You would have given your life to save Bell. Don't you know what that meant to us? You gave us all courage! Hmm. <laughs> Maybe you should have kept some for yourself. I mean, are you really gonna throw your happiness away? The rose is your only hope, isn't it? Well, it's the only hope for Cogsworth and the others, too. So don't throw away your last chance. Remember what it was like before Belle lived here? See? You can't give up. Not now. I know one thing. What? This castle belongs to me. Zaldin will never be welcome here.
吧。After all, you had me worried. I was afraid you'd given up for good. What do you guys really want? Kingdom Hearts. When Kingdom Hearts is ours, we can exist fully and completely. <laughs> So you see, Beast. That's why we need your heartless and your nobody. Yeah. Ha! Yeah. Ha! 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 
Hmm. Where are you going with that key item? Basically, they asked us to go get the rose back from the man, and it's a bit huge. Get out! And was I cussing up with this? Do anything about it? Which I am. Let's go! And here we go. Is that? Look! It's the rose! Travel light. What shall I leave behind? Bell or the rose? has like a million lances. Yeah. He, he's Lance. A lot of Lance. Where's the fun in this? We stop it. Yeah. Have to me a chance Oh wait, I did the wisdom plan? No, that's not what I wanted. Are you <laughs> doing breathing emphasis? Yeah. 
Here, it's yours again. Belle? I know. You want me to leave the castle. <sighs> what matters is, you weren't hurt by Zaldan. You're safe. And, um, 
I'm very grateful to you for bringing the rose back to me. Hmm. Thank you. It's the least I could do. You've been good to me, and you didn't have to be. Listen, Belle. Yes? <sighs> Say it. Go on. Come on. You can do it. We have confidence. Don't be bashful, Mal. Well, I'd like you to stay with me, please. I will. My strong music. Hey, did you see the look on Belle's face when she grabbed that rose? Huh? Yup, she sure was having fun, all right. She's rather unique, isn't she? Always ready for a little adventure. The two of them do seem made for each other. Yeah, they sure do. Yes. Taylor Oh. Hey, everybody. I'm a strange reading. Are you sure? Let me see. Look, it's all cloudy and kind of fuzzy. Probably just a glitch. I don't know. Those two are so closed off. I'm kind of nervous up there. And then you have to sit over here, it's like. Yeah, okay. Oh, okay. Um, I just wanted to real quick look at the tail. See what we had by way of answer reports. Yeah, so we have a bunch of answer reports. I wonder when we get through. What can we? Let's read one and two. My efforts these many years have come to fruition. With the world I govern having become a paradise worthy of being called Radiant Guardian. Nurtured by the pure water that is the source of life, fragrant blossoms, oh, fl flowers bloom in abundance, and the people face, and the people face each day with hopeful smiles. <laughs> but where there is light, darkness also lurks. As I have noted in my earlier reports, I must solve this mystery of the darkness of the heart. This paradise depends on it. I shall perform an experiment to probe the depths of a person's heart. One of my own apprentices, Zinohart, has volunteered to be a subject. The young man has served me ever since I nursed him back from death's door some years ago. He has lost all of his memories of the time. The later showed remarkable intellectual curiosity and readily absorbed my teaching of gaining wisdom. Any mental immaturity is surely due to his young age. If I explore Xenohart's heart, Xenohart's heart, with psychological tests, I may be able to recall the past locked away within. My apprentice, Evan, has also shown great interest in Xenohart's memories. But is he really the right subject? Xenohart does indeed exhibit extraordinary talents. Too extraordinary. Perhaps they are even superheroes. I have made a grave mistake. My study of the darkness of the heart began with a simple psychological test and quickly snowballed. Spurred on by my young princess Ienzo, I constructed a massive laboratory in the basement of my castle. Unbeknownst to me, six of my, my six apprentices then began collecting a large number of subjects on which to perform dangerous experiments into the darkness of the heart. 
as soon as I found out, I called my apprentices together and ordered them to not only cease their studies, but to destroy the results of the research thus far. What on earth happened within the hearts of my six beloved apprentices? While pursuing the mystery of the darkness of the heart, could they themselves have strayed into its depths? Yet I remain most foolish of all for having begun these experiments. We are not meant to interfere with the depths of another's heart, no matter what our reasons for doing so. My error has spun me into despair. A visitor from another world soothed my dejected soul. A tiny king named Mickey came wielding a legendary key, the infamous Keyblade, said to both ca bring chaos and prosperity to the world. He was very knowledgeable on many topics, and we deepened our friendship as we conversed companionably. Upon his device, oh, I'm sorry, advice, I got my glasses on, I decided to review the data obtained at my basement lab. That is when I discovered the Ansem reports. Though they bore my name, the only one I had written was number zero. Apparently, he had gone on to pen numbers one through eight himself. Yes, the first subject in my foolish experiments. So Xehanort, as we learned earlier, took on the name Ansem, and he was the one responsible for one through eight of the reports he read in the first game. This is basically going over. Uh, yeah, if you want to hang out on... Um, Let's, let's see if we can find three before we're going on to four. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we'll call it here for today. We'll save. At least for more. I don't know, we'll do more. And we got Get up and walk around. I've been asleep. Alright, so thank you for watching. Oop, that's the wrong button. Um, one of these buttons. This button? This button. Alright. Thank you. Here we go.